You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. The other night, dear, as I lay sleeping, I dreamed I held you in my arms. When I awoke, dear, I was mistaken. So I hung my head. Hi, this is Miss Collins with your History Fact of the Week. Today we're talking about presidential vetoes. And a veto is the power of the president to veto or say no to a bill sent from Congress. Um, basically, he says he refuses to sign a bill from Congress that would become a law if he signed it, but he says no, it's not going to become a law. So I'm going to read you a list of the presidents who had no vetoes, who never um, had a veto. John Adams, Thomas Jefferson, John Quincy Adams, um, William Henry Harrison, Zachary Taylor, Mill Millard Fillmore, and James Garfield. Those presidents never had a veto, never you know, had a veto when they were in office, never turned down a bill from Congress. Now, there's one president who had the most vetoes when he was president, and he had the most vetoes by far. So I want to see if you can guess which president had the most vetoes of any president in office. Take a guess. The president was FDR, or Franklin Delano Roosevelt. He had, are you ready, 635 vetoes. Now, that probably has a lot to do with the fact that he was elected to four terms. But 635 vetoes is still a lot of vetoes. So FDR had the most vetoes of any president. And that's your history fact of the week. Hi, I am here with three tips to help with anxiety. What are three things you can see? 
Look around the room. What are three things you can hear? And finally, move three parts of your body. These will all help take your mind off of what is causing you anxiety. This is Mr. Warrington with your Astronomy Fact of the Week. We've gotten done with the, the eclipse, and now there's lots of stuff to still see in the night sky. Everyone's probably seen the Big Dipper. The Big Dipper is one of the most easily identified asterisms, part of a constellation, that you can find. And another thing to look for with the with uh, Big Dipper, this arc that forms the Big Dipper's handle, if you follow that arc, it's called Arc to Arcturus. This is an amazing star to look at. It's really bright. It twinkles. I've seen it twinkle three or four different colors sometimes. Really nice one to look at, and it's really bright. Another thing you can do with the Big Dipper, these two stars are called the pointer stars, and this is off my graphic, but these two stars point to the pole star, and you probably know that as Polaris. You probably know it better as the North Star. Thanks. Hello, Shawnee. Today is Friday, April 19th, and we welcome you to your Brave Time announcements. Shawnee Middle School co choirs and orchestra students recently participated on the Ohio Music Association event held at Wisenborn Music School. They received the following ratings. Superior ratings were earned by Landon Anders, Lily Long, Christine Padilla, Liz Hill, Carly Whited, Anna Church, Ziva Eccles, Aubrey Parkman, and Tilly Snyder. Excellent ratings were earned by Zane DeWeese, Adeline Glodek, Cashmere Lacey, Gabby Mead, Lila Reif, and Bailey Wise. Congrats to all of you. Switching gears. Do you love Chick-fil-A? Then here's an excuse to go while also helping out the high school prom committee. On April 23rd, you can enjoy the Dine to Donate event at our local Chick-fil-A from 5 to 8 p.m. and enjoy some great food while helping out the older students and maybe your older siblings as shown me. In news from Clark State, College for Kids and Teens is back this summer. This pre-college camp program offers a great opportunity for middle school students to learn new skills, make new friends, and begin to explore careers. Camp sessions are from 8.30 to 3 in late June and early July at a cost of 175 Middle school students can register for the Airspace Experience Camp, where you learn about the science beyond flight, aircraft design, navigation systems, and satellites. Or the Medical Mystery and Immersive Patient Care Camp, where you go behind the scenes in the medical field and conduct lab tests, learn about diagnosing and caring for patients. If you're interested, <laughs> If you're interested, you can talk to Mrs. Akers or go to Clark State College for Kids and Teens website to learn more to register. In today's quote of the day, if you cannot do great things, do small things in a great way, Napoleon Hill. Birthday wishes for this week go out to Savannah Deal, Hudson Mertens, Kale Vast, and Rachel Adams. Happy birthday to you. Some celebrity birthdays are Kathy Bitstein, Cooper Barnes, Kourtney Kardashian, and Sadie Sink. On this day in history, in 1775, Paul Revere and others are captured by the British troops, riding from Lexington to Concord in the infamous Paul Revere Midnight Ride. And fun and wacky holidays, today is Team World Day. And for your weather forecast, today will be a high of 64 and a low of 42 with scattered showers. Now we ask you to please stand and join us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thanks for watching and have a great day and weekend.